Welcome back to the Red Carpet Re-Up. Today, we're diving into Dame Dash's fiery remarks about Jay-Z after the auction of his Rockefeller shares didn't exactly go as planned. From legal battles to surprising bidders, there's a lot to unpack here. So let's get into it. Dame Dash recently auctioned off his one-third ownership in Rockefeller, but things didn't go quite the way he expected. Instead of the millions he hoped for, New York State bought the shares for just one million. Yes, one million, to settle Dash's debts, which are reportedly close to 10 million. Yikes, Dash didn't hold back in his frustration. He called out Jay-Z saying, and I quote, homie isn't as big as he portrays, ouch. He even pointed out that Jay, despite being a billionaire, didn't think the shares were worth $3 million. That's got a sting, right? Here's where it gets even more interesting. Drake apparently entered the chat. Dash revealed that Drake made a whopping $6 million bid at one point, but then disappeared without any explanation. Dash said, Drake did put a bid in for $6 million, but then he disappeared. I don't know what happened. This could have been a game changer, but instead, it's just another question mark in this saga. But let's talk about why these shares even ended up on the auction block. Dame Dash owes millions in back taxes, unpaid child support, and legal fees, including nearly one million to a filmmaker who sued him. And get this, the share's only real asset? The copyright to Jay-Z's Reasonable Doubt album. Here's where it gets tricky. Dame accused Jay-Z of trying to poison the auction by claiming that the rights to Reasonable Doubt will revert back to him in 2031. Lawyers for New York State, however, argued that the copyright belongs to Rockefeller Inc. until 2098. Talk about a legal showdown. And if you're wondering who actually bought these shares, it was an anonymous New York State employee who plans to flip them for a higher price. Imagine being in the middle of that drama. So what does this all mean? For Dame Dash, it's a harsh reality check. And for Jay-Z, it's another day dodging drama. As for the future of those shares, the story is far from over. Whether it's Drake, Jay-Z, or someone else stepping in, this saga proves that the music business is just as messy as it is glamorous. What do you think about Dame Dash's comments? Is he right to call out Jay-Z? Or is this just another chapter in their long-running feud? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more updates from the Red Carpet Re-Up. Until next time, stay tuned and stay sharp.